Well, good morning. It's Monday. And you guys, uh, we are at any lab test now. And today from 10 to 1, you can come down and give blood. And if you do, Hot Valley's involved in this. So it's a pint for a pint. You'll get a little a little coupon that you can go to Hot Valley and get a pint of your favorite beer. If you're underage or you don't drink, you can get your favorite soda. And any lab test now is going to also give you a free vitamin B shot. So um, we're going to talk to Stephanie here. This goes on till one o'clock. Hi, Stephanie. Hi. So tell them what anytime fit, any lab test now is. <laughs> anytime fitness. I get your gym and you mixed up, you know. And I don't own anytime no, fitness no, either. Just, yeah. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, any lab test now is a walk-in clinic where we provide over eight thousand um, blood tests to people without. They do not need to be sent in here by a doctor. We provide doctor's orders here. So insurance. We do not take insurance. So go ahead. So because, because the reason is a lot of people like me have very high deductibles and I can't afford to go to the doctor and then get my, all my blood work done. So I can just come here and do that on my own. Correct. Yes. Um, oftentimes, well, it's a time saver. It's a money saver. So you don't have to make that appointment. You don't have to convince your doctor of the tests you need. Um, you can come in here and oftentimes just get a simple um, answer to something and if you're low on iron, if your B12 is low, um, if you're feeling off, you can come in and get just a regular blood test to see how, what your blood levels are at. Don't you think a lot more people are, want to manage their own health too? We want to, I, I want to know what my vitamin D level is, but I can't afford to go to the doctor to do that. Absolutely. And there's so much education that you can get yourself online if you go on reputable um, websites like the, the Mayo Clinic, for instance. Um, you can go find out information about like okay, I have low vitamin D, this is what I need to do to get myself back up to par. So you can come in here, get that test, and skip the whole three, four week doctor. And you guys do vitamin B shots, you do all kinds of different things like that as well. We do, we do anything. We have panels, we have, um, you know, we do diabetic testing, we do cholesterol, we do STD testing, basic blood work, we do a lot of hormone testing, um, we do a lot of testosterone checks for men, women coming in here, going through menopause or perimenopause come in and they get their um, estrogen levels checked. So, and it's all anonymous, which is important to your clients. Yeah, any of it can be anonymous. I mean, oftentimes people don't care about their, you know, CBC, their blood count. They're not wanting to be anonymous, but an STD test for sure. Um, a lot of people like to come in here because you don't, I think I told you before, you don't have to go to the family doctor you've known for 25 years. Um, you know, couples come in here that are newly dating and they want to get tested together just to make sure that the, you know, everything's on the up and up. So um, it, that, that's kind of nice. I love that. Everybody always comes on here, you guys. So this is where it is. They're on Garfield and it's just right on the way between, um, what is it, 7th, 6th and 7th and 11th on Garfield. And it's any lab test now. But today we are going to, we're at the blood mobile. You got to go in the other door, Laura. That door there. There you go. Everybody always comes on here and says, what a great idea. Every time we do this, I think it's... Well, I think I was telling you, um, oh, other door. <laughs> other door. Um, I think what I was telling you is that um, a lot of people don't know that this is even available. And I was telling you earlier that I still have friends that I run into that are like, what? You can do what? I don't have to go to the doctor. I can just walk right in the door. Um, so doing things like this in the community kind of helps let people know what we do and what's available. Uh, Rick Olson, these are available in other places, Texas, and um, he's in another state, but it, you'd have to... Basically, they're all over. Um, there, There's none in California, but if you go on our website, you can just put in um, the location that you're looking for and it'll tell you where they all are. But right. it's a franchise. So you guys, today again, we have Bloodworks Northwest um, here and they're doing blood test, T taking blood. So tell them who you are. I'm Isaac Gordon. I work here at Lane Bloodworks. I'm a phlebotomist. So why is this so important to give, especially this time of year? Well, around this time of year, we often fall short in our blood supply because you know, everybody's so busy with the holidays and there are accidents and things that happen and we, we still need blood year round. So what are the levels like right now? Is there any, is, are we doing all right? And these are used for what? What kind of, what, what's the blood uh, used so it, for? It, well, the blood is used for, for many things. Some people need blood every single day, uh, you know, just to, to survive if they have, you know, low platelets and they need platelet transfusions uh, or like I said, accidents are a big thing. Um, 
I'm sorry, what was the first question? No, that you got it. You got you got it all in there. Go ahead and get her information. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm taking your time here. So again, you guys, this is cool. How are you? Fantastic. You guys are very set up, aren't you? There isn't anything we can't do on here except for use the restroom because there isn't one. <laughs> so why is this? You get up here, man. Come on. Right. Come here. <laughs> so why is this important? Uh, why is giving blood important? Um, saving lives. And every time that you donate with one of these bags of blood, um, we can potentially use three people can get it. Um, Seriously? Yeah, plasma, red cells, and platelets are what we're separating out of them. So, yeah, you're potentially helping three lives rather than just one today. So what are the things people don't understand, like the wives' tale, the fears, or the things that they don't get? Tattoos is a big one. Uh, a lot of people think that since you've had a tattoo that you can't donate, but as long as it's at a licensed facility in Oregon, Idaho, Washington, or California, you're going to be A-OK -okay to donate. Um, just not from your neighbor's garage. It Exactly, yeah. No her. stick and pokes. Uh, She's a comedian in the oh, group, isn't she? I like your hair, too. Thank you. I like your hair. Thank you. I thought you kind of would, yeah. So, and also, yeah. um, uh, people, I think sometimes people have misconceptions about uh, different communities that can give, LGBT and that kind of yeah. thing. Yeah. Um, so, LGBTQ, you, you're more than welcome to. We just say um, for male to male contact for at least a year, we want to make sure that that's still, um, that you're not having any male to male contact for a year. Um, it's just kind of an outdated rule with the FDA, but still is in place. Um, but other than that, um, there's not really any limitations on the LGBT community. Uh, just want to make sure that your blood's still healthy and safe, and we'll make sure to all test all of that, and yeah. When people come in here, like, what, what is it normally like? Do you get do you get quite a few people using the blood mobile? Oh yes, yes. We have people that tell us all the time that if it wasn't for us showing up, they wouldn't donate because when they get off work, the last thing they want to do is drive across town, and I get that. Yeah. So and Hot Valley's doing a pint to pint thing, aren't they? Yes, sure we are. do it every fall. They in give fact, us the glasses are back there. Yeah. That you can win today. They give us a glass and a coupon for a pint of beer. And you give us a pint of blood, and they'll give you that. So how important is it that somebody like a Hot Valley, a business like that, get involved with this? Hop Valley has been a big promoter with us for a long time. Since I've been at the blood bank, we've been, and that's been since 2013. Wow. And I think it's, it's, we also have a working relationship like that with Dutch Bros. And I think that's good that the community can see that they're involved because this is probably the most vital thing that somebody could do. So when everybody's talking about holiday gifts and what do I get someone, um, or what can I do for other people, we always think about, and, and, and they're great things, giving to the homeless and all these kind of things, those are great things to do. But this is one that you don't know whose life you're really making an impact on, just on a daily basis. I stay at the blood bank because of the donors. There isn't a more unselfish group of people around. They are giving, and if they met the person on the street that may get their blood, they may not like that person, but they continue to do it. And I, I stay for the donors. I love them. Thanks, you guys. Thank you. Oh, man, thank you very much. So, again, you guys, we're at any lab test now, and you can come down between 10 and, 10 and 1 o'clock today, and you can give blood, and then Hot Valley will give you a pint for a pint. So if you give a pint of blood, they will give you a pint of at their location or you can get soda if you're not a person who drinks beer and uh, again there's a uh, people coming in through here so Stephanie thanks for doing this thank you you should have heard what I just heard them talking about they were saying you know all the people that are need this on a daily basis that mm -hmm. we don't even think about we think about accidents and we think about that but we don't think about on a daily basis there's people with that need this stuff yeah so thanks for doing this. Yeah, actually, I mean, when you think about that, I wonder how many people per day they need. Like, you know, it would be nice to get a, an idea. How many people per day do you need to donate blood to keep all those people? Um, do you guys know right. how many people do you need per day to really keep the supply where so you need? Keep our supply up between our center and our mobiles. We Hold need on. to collect around 100 units a day. So say that again. Uh, to uh, supply our hospitals with the blood they need, we need to collect around 100 units between our center and our mobiles every single day. How many, so how many locations, how many centers? So we have the one center here, which is on Willamette Street, and then we have uh, two buses and an inside setup where we can set up in like gymnasiums or office buildings and, and do that. So, we so how do businesses like what Stephanie just did today, how do they get a hold of you and, and to set this up to have it come to their business? Uh, I would call Bloodworks. Uh, 
Let me get a number for you. And Do you guys have a phone number handy? Yeah, there oh, there you go. That's one. There's one right there, you guys. If you're a business and you want to have them come locate at your facility, then you can call in and get that set up through Bloodworks Northwest. And I've, it's super easy, too. I've actually done it twice because uh -huh. I did it at my other So this is the second time we've done it. And it's like people would think, oh, my gosh, what a hassle. I've got to call them, you know, meet, meet with them 100 times. It's really easy. You guys are super efficient. Like you have a format and you call and you pick a date and... It's really simple. It's really simple to be involved. Matt Kendall's a real estate broker here. He said, super fast, super easy, and get in and get a pint in return. Get in there, folks are really helping out. The staff is great, too. So you guys have you have a popularity group. You do well on the survey, says. <laughs> and great. it's really cozy in here. Yeah, it's really nice, Being and you got nice. funny, and be yes. sure and ask for the comedian. All right, Steph, thank you. Yes, All right, you guys, you. so happy holidays. Have a great day. Have a great holiday. And here's the way to come down until 1 o'clock. This is the ultimate gift that you can give somebody that you don't even know, which is a great thing. One more thing. Go for it. Um, and it, actually, an awesome Christmas gift to give somebody is a gift certificate to the lab or um, because... Oh, yeah. Yeah. So um, people would love to get a gift certificate. We also do, um, you know, a genetic test. I mean, there's a ton of things that you can use down here. Um, you can get vitamin B12 shots. You can get our Relax Formula shot. You can... Um, just do a basic checkup. So it, that's kind of a cool gift, too. Yeah, that's a great gift idea. And remember, also, for the, if you come down today, not only do you get a pint, you're also going to get a free vitamin B shot at the clinic. And uh, I had one. It's great. I also like the other one, too, though, the, the rest one. The, yeah, the relax. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Which Steph. a lot of us need in this time. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Yeah. All right, you guys. So today at noon, we're going to be in Venita. And we're going to be with uh, St. Vincent de Paul to Operation Santa, where they're going to be delivering presents to people in our community who otherwise would not have them. So, yeah, it's a good day. So we'll see you around noon uh, coming to you from Benita with St. Vincent de Paul. All right, I'm Rick Dancer. See you guys later. Bye-bye.